Hi guys, my name is Rahul and I am a third year CSE course student at VIT Valor. And in this video, I will be reviewing my uh, DSA course. Like, how is it? I will be telling you about the few topics uh, that we were taught, about few algorithms. Is it worth it? And, you know, uh, like, is it good and up to date? And, you know, basically things related to it. So without wasting time, let's get started. So from second year onwards, you'll start getting your DSA courses and it is basically divided into two parts. One is the actual DSA part, which you will do in your second year first sem. And other is the DA part, which is known as design and analysis of algorithm, which you will do in your second sem, second year. Now, uh, in the second sem, you will have your DSA courses. So in DSA, you will be learning about stacks, queues, trees, heap, arrays, and you know, some basic algorithm related to it. Now, one of the important point to note here is that you need to be good in either C or C++ because you will be asked by your teacher to write code in paper. So be prepared with that. And of course, in the DSA lab exams, you will be given a question and you need to solve it using data structures. So you will be coding in computer. So you should be knowing the basics of C and C++. Then we have a uh, DA part, which is uh, mainly about algorithms. So in this, you will be going through a lot of algorithms and you need to like kind of identify which case require which algorithm. So I have made a list of like few algorithms that you will be reading. So it might appear here or there. So uh, that's about uh, the DA course and the DSA course. Overall, I like to say that uh, the DSA course is pretty good you will have a good understanding about data structures but the DA that is related to algorithm is a bit outdated because the algorithms that you will be taught are pretty old and uh, you know like uh, there are new algorithms that are much more uh, easier to code as well as they're much more faster but still we have to study I mean this is not something which is controlled by VIT uh, I think the UGC sets the syllabus for what is, uh, whatever is being taught. So this is not something related to VIT. So overall, uh, you'll have a good understanding about DSA. And of course, you need to practice like on Geeks for Geeks and Lead Code and Code Share. That is separate. But if you are just studying this course, you will have a good understanding about DSA. And uh, that's it about this video, guys. I hope you liked it. And if you did, with the like button. And make sure that you subscribe because I will be coming up with more videos on VIT. Like, uh, I'm getting a lot of questions on my DMs and on comments. So I will be uh, making a video on that. So make sure that you subscribe. And uh, till then, bye-bye. And I'll be doing my next video.